hi guys welcome back to my channel so you've already seen by the title of the video that in today's video i'm going to be talking about hermosa flow which is a cosmetic line owned by umbali if you don't know her i'm gonna put a details right here anyway a lot of you actually really requested for me to do this video and i've taken time but we are here and we're gonna do it so i've got the eyeshadow palette and i've got the highlighting palette as well as the lipstick so that is what i'm going to be trying in this video thank you to foshini for sending me this beautiful hairband you guys are going to be seeing this a lot so right here at the back it's prescribed desert dusk eyeshadow palette which rings uh, to me huda beauty if you don't know this is the huda beauty desert dusk palette and uh, this is the hermosa floor palette which is uh, really different but they've got the same name i wish that there could have been more creativity in terms of names and this palette would represent Hermosa Floor as a different entity apart from like copying exactly what Huda Beauty is about and then when you open it you can see it's got really amazing shades that to me is a really eye-catching they look as if they are so friendly to dark skin and it has got shimmer shades it also has a matte shades as well as glitter which is very rare in palettes in most cases when you look at palettes you find them to have a lot of like shimmer and matte shades i really like the fact that she did combine the palette with a little bit of some glitter shades which makes actually the palette versatile by just looking at it you also do have like the purple shades you have the peachy orange you also have the brown the reds and literally guys the first thing when i looked at the palette i thought oh my word it is super versatile i actually created this look before but ne never have i created it with the hermosa palette so personally i'm gonna go for the this yellow the glitter that's what i'm going to be using but also to make the look a little bit more interesting as well as to try other eyeshadow quads i'm gonna go with the browns and the orange just so we see how the matte shades are with the shimmer shades what i'm going to do is i'm just going to swatch them on my hand so that you can see how they look like on dark skin as well as on a woman of color First I said that I love you when you ain't say that shit back It's kinda hard to just trust you when both your feelings don't match Got me showing less emotions, I don't wanna get attached Once I give you my word, I swear it ain't no going back Once I give you my heart, you better keep that shit intact Instead of assuming the words, girl, I'm just here stating facts You want me to take you back, I want you to take me back You want me to take you back I know I had said that I was going to only swatch the shimmer shades But guys, I was honestly like so shoot when i was trying the like what <laughs> i was so sure guys with the shimmer shades they apply so seamlessly they are so soft guys like when i find good makeup i feel like honestly that's how much i love makeup i feel like dropping a tear because it's so good you guys saw it for yourselves the way that the shimmer shades apply they apply so seamlessly as well as the matte shades like wow i always struggle when i'm looking for a palette to find like matte shades that are pigment you understand it's a very very hard so what I'm going to do is I'm going to start doing the eyeshadow look and someone wanted to come for me by saying I, I don't give enough justice to eyeshadow palettes by applying them on my eyelids without using an eyeshadow base yes I do not do that on this channel because what is the point of me using an eyeshadow base when I am reviewing a palette I want to see how the palette works without like manipulating the ability of the palette so on this channel we do not use an eyeshadow base if we are reviewing a palette how many people can actually use an eyeshadow base anyway so to start off my look i'm gonna go in with this brown that is right here i've gotten so close to the camera because i want you guys to see how the shades are so by just starting off i am going to pack this brown on my eyelid instantly guys like there is no lie there there is no freaking lies you guys can see it for yourselves that the pigment is so amazing and also the four 
fallout is quite minimum and it feels so soft like the matte shades they feel very very soft and i feel like i am so happy with this brown color because i'm not trying to like make it look darker than it, it actually is it is literally just giving me like enough color payoff without even me trying to like manipulate it yeah. Whole time they was plotting, man, I wish they was for you. You gotta watch your back, your friend. Quite like the fact that this palette comes with a mirror. So instead of me having to use like my other mirrors, I can literally just look like, look in the mirror of this palette and use it to do like my eyeshadow looks. So side they disloyal. I gotta watch my crown, cause from birth I've been royal. And that's from the soil. Okay, the other thing you see, there is literally zero fallout. Literally zero, guys. Like, there's no fallout. And I didn't use any eyeshadow base to grab the eyeshadow. It's literally just the concealer that I did drag from my um, eyebrows. So, like, zero to minimum fallout there, guys. Like, no lies detected. That's, like, really shocking and amazing. Next, I'm going to take this deep brown. And that's what I'm going to use to define my crease. First I said that I love you when you ain't say that shit back It's kinda hard to just trust you when both your feelings don't match Got me showing less emotions, I don't wanna get attached Once I give you my word, I swear it ain't no going back Once I give you my heart, you better keep that shit intact Instead of assuming no words, girl, I'm just here stating facts you To blend out my eyes, I'm gonna take this contour it color And I am just going to soften my eyes a little bit you want me to take you back? I want you to take me back you want me to take you back i want you to take me back so tell me is you gonna ride out when the chips fall i seen too many people leave when it get hot i'm tired of going back and forth when we pissed off most of my friends don't went through it and they still so apart from the fact that this palette has got really amazing pigments i love that all the shades in the palette have got names glow up stay humble say pink roses contour it floor whole mood sister <laughs> gold getter miss independent princess yes queen oh sweetheart gold darling which is what i'm gonna go in with now queen drip angel face and brow it i love that i hate to be saying oh guys then i'm gonna take this orange shade which doesn't have a name oh my god i don't know what you call it. absolutely don't like that about palette about other palettes but i love that these ones are named and you actually know what you're picking out without trying to explain how the color looks like i'm gonna go in with a gold darling and i'm not going to be using like glitter glue because i want to see how the glitter is on its own without me having to use like a, a glue for it so with a flat brush i'm just going to dunk the glitter on my eyelid my flat brush is so old guys but i love it and i'm just going to start sculpting the glitter shade on my eyelid see they gonna try and tell you what they think is good for you Whole time. and instantly the glitter sticks on because it is soft the way that it's made is very soft and not chunky so instantly it like sticks on perfectly they was plotting man i wish they was for you you gotta watch your back your front your side they disloyal i gotta watch my crown cause from birth i've been royal and that's from the soil yeah Two strong-minded individuals What happen when y'all both reach the pinnacle Things start to get physical What make it worse, the motherfucker live with you Talking what you didn't do and what they did for you You just praying for a miracle Where is the fallout, guys? Please, where is the fallout? Because we all know glitter is messy, guys Let me just show you close-up, right? So you can see how the glitter is like You can see it's very creamy Because I'm extra and I'm fabulous And I love this palette <laughs> I'm gonna take this brown here and I'm just gonna use that as my blush I really love that it's warm and it's like orange and brown skin friendly Cause they been with you through the good and the bad times made it pivotal All them feelings that you hold inside it will hinder To maximize the use of this palette I'm gonna go back into the palette and take glow up And just put it like in the inner corner of my eyes Yes, to use up the makeup look 
and sort of like open up my eyes you so let it go to close off this palette guys i absolutely love this palette it's uh, amazing balls i would probably say it's one of my favorite palettes a nine out of ten the only thing that put me off with regards to the palette was the name but i'm not applying the name i'm, I'm applying the pigment of the eyeshadow which is literally to die for the packaging so different and so pretty so i'm gonna move on to the next thing that i also got from hemo also floor cosmetics the highlighting palette the highlighting palette is called uh, the glow gang highlighter and also comes in a very pretty unique black roses packaging and uh, it's got ingredients right here at the back and these are the shades there is four shades in in the palette which makes it like quad palette unlike the eyeshadow palette the highlighting palette does not have a names for the highlighters in the pan which is obviously a 10 off like i say but like i said also we are not applying the names we want to see how the palette performs so i'm gonna start swatching and i'm gonna start with this one first all the highlighter shades appear to be very soft to me and i like that in a highlighter because i hate a highlighter that disintegrates and has got texture and that almost looks like glitter on skin so what i'm going to do is i'm gonna go in with this one which is is the darkest of them all and i feel like that favors my skin tone a little bit more than um the other ones which i think are absolutely amazing especially like this one with halo use it would look very nice on people that are like light skin like Oh my god oh my word very thin line between looking glowy and ashy when it comes to highlighters for women of color that is so so nice and very soft very subtle applies softly no texture like there is no texture i hate highlighters that have texture because then if you've got maybe like acne or if you've got uh skin that is not smooth they just like emphasize on the bumps that you have on your skin I'm just gonna go in with a little bit more here on my nose and just like blend it out Cutie patootie. The last thing in this palette is the lipstick, which also re really inspired my eyes because I didn't want any other color that I was going to play with in the eyeshadow to contrast the lip color. That's why I went for the yellow and the browns. This comes in a very nice packaging that is sleek, that is very attractive with a gold detailing on the on the top of the opening. And the lipstick itself is called Dream Chaser and it's a red. So reds are very tricky. They can either make you look like you're homeless or they can either make you look like you're bougie and you are moneyed and and expensive so you can see the color of my teeth if you want to see if a red lipstick looks good on you you look at the color of your teeth if they turn yellow it's the wrong red for you I've seen a lot of people go crazy about this color so I want to see how the red actually looks like on me I'm hoping that my teeth do not turn yellow and on application I can feel that it is such a velvety uh, sort of like not too thin consistent consistency it's a little bit like thin but as well not too thin and i can see as i'm applying it and talking it is drying instantly so i gotta stop talking and just apply the lipstick and tell you guys what i think i hit at the end all of felons that you hold inside it will hinder you so at first i said that i love you when you ain't say that shit back it's kind of hard to just trust you when both your feelings don't match got me showing less emotions i don't want to get attached once i give you my word i swear it ain't no going back once i give you my heart you better keep that shit intact instead of assuming the words girl i'm just here stating facts you want me to take you back i want you to take me back you want me to take you back i want you to take me back so tell me so i finished a applying the lipstick and it it is very drying um if you're not a big fan of like super super matte lipsticks i would definitely say this is not your lipstick but if you're that person who loves a matte lipstick that is like 
out there that is bold that is dry that is matte then this is your lipstick i usually wear like lip glosses i usually wear like lip glosses and i'm kind of feeling like my lips are tight but i totally understand that because this is me i'm a lip gloss girl i'm not really like a matte lipstick person but i would definitely rock this lipstick my teeth are white they are white guys like i am feeling myself i am really feeling myself and i of course went on and i put my earrings because what's a vongai tutorial without earrings i mean <laughs> earrings make everything happen overall i would say i really this brand is amazing guys like the pots were made the pots were cooked the pots were turned upside down the palette nine out of ten the only thing that's taking off a little bit of the points is for me the name i would have really loved it to have like a different name that would have been super banging but in terms of pigment 10 out of 10 in terms of like applications uh, the way it's seamless 10 out of 10 the highlights are dark skin friendly girl i mean oh i love it 10 out of 10 i have actually never loved a brand as much as i i've loved these this amazing stuff so really the pots were done and is it a recommendation from me as we always end uh, our reviews definitely definitely spend your coins i will see myself spending my money again and again and again and i'm hoping in the future the formula does not change because if it changes that would be really heartbreaking because these products are so amazing i think you guys can testify yourselves i'm filming at night and if you're filming at night and you look like this then the products are really good so i hope you guys enjoyed this review if you did please give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to leave your comments share with your friends and let's get engaging i love you guys for watching me today and i will see you next time Bye. Is you gon' ride out when the chips fall? I seen too many people leave when it get hot. I'm tired of going back and forth when we pissed off. Most of my friends don't went through it and they stood tall. See, they gon' try and tell you what they think is good for you. Whole time they was plotting, man, I wish they was for you. You gotta watch your back, your front, your side, they disloyal.